Hey guys, Naturally Wild here, and today we are going to be going fishing. We are going to be using a bunch of lures, bread, fake worms, and a bunch of other cool stuff to fish. My pole is, is an ugly stick, so it has great bending ability, which that's great for a smallmouth bass, which we are going to be catching today. And if not, we are going to be catching sunnies and mostly catfish, because there's tons of catfish in the park. Let's get right into it. I have my cameraman behind the camera, and let's go. Yo, what is up guys? Naturally Wild here. Back, um, there's a huge, like, five antler deer in Clove Lakes right now. And I'm going to sneak up on it and get a good shot. Jaden! Okay, ready for this? It's okay. Dude, it has a tag on it. It has a tag on it. It has a tag around its neck and it has an ear puncture. You guys seeing that? Wait one second. Let me get any closer that I can. Never mind, it's like a two, two pronged ear. Hi. Oh my god, he's adorable. Do you guys see that? Hi. Hi. Oh my god. I'm super close to it. Hi. Whoa, holy crap. This is insane. It's tagged too, so that means it's a protective species right now. Not protective, but it's being protected by Clove Lakes. Now, I don't want to get too close to it just because I want to leave it alone, but at the same time, I do want to keep a close eye on it just because I don't want it to get hurt or hit by a bus or something. I don't know. I'm kind of freaking out right now. Because this is the first actual big animal that I'm showing on my channel. So if I get close to it, I'll um, log back on. But I'll see you in a little while. And quick change plans. We have been catching nothing. So what we are going to be doing is exploring Clove Lakes. Not exactly exploring, but we're going to go through our favorite spots, our favorite fishing spots, favorites places just to hang out and yeah let's go now tinkers comes all shapes and sizes depending on what fish you're trying to catch now i usually i don't use bread the last time it worked very well so i'm going to try that again all of these worms right here are plastic but they are very good at catching catfish carp and sunnies depending on the size now right here we have a lure now this is called a carp lure. Now carp lure has a huge hook on the end and is very shiny depending on what kind of carp and fish you're trying to catch. 